In this video, we'll show you how to bypass the stock SAS or air pump on a Volvo. The first thing you want to do is go ahead and take the ECU apart, which has been documented in previous videos. Then locate pins 37 and 32. If you look on the actual board, you can see numbers written out finally. In this case, this is pin 37, 32 is right here. Now what you want to do is you want to solder in a diode to allow electricity to flow one way but not the other between 37 and 32. The key is you want to make sure the orientation of the diode allows electricity to flow towards 37 but not back. In this instance, I've gone ahead and made a little jumper for it with the diode using green and red wire only to illustrate the direction of flow. You can simply solder your diode directly to the board. As you can see, I placed it on pin 37. Here's 36, 35, 34, 33, 32. With the jumper in place, I supply a small dab of solder to the first pin. Then the second pin. This modification should take you no more than an hour. At this point, let those solder joints cool down and then you can go ahead and button the ECU back up and place it back in the car.